Good morning, campers. As you look at this table and you see all this mess, you may ask yourself, gee, what all goes into a backpack? I will deal with my backpack today, and we'll deal with Nancy's tomorrow. Here's what I'm carrying. First off, let me back up so you can see it. Here's a tent. There's our tent. Dink. There's the poles for the tent. Here we have my Thermarest sleep pad. Sleeps as good as a firm mattress, loaded up with air. And here you see our sleeping bags. It actually has a camp pillow in it. Now, a word of explanation about the sleeping bag. That's not a real sleeping bag. That's a fleece liner for a sleeping bag. We figured it would be warm enough just to take those. However, last night it got down into the 40s, and we spent a very cold night. Ah, doesn't help my runny nose at all, but that's what I'm taking. Here we get into the clothing side of things. Here's my rain jacket. Necessary piece of gear because it rains up here and we have to hike in it. Here's my bag of extra clothes. There's city clothes in there. You can see the white thing there is my shirt and underneath that is my city pants. Extra pairs of socks. The long green thing there, if you can see it, is a towel. On the bottom, we've got the, the pants legs. Here we go, upside down. Watch out, don't get dizzy. There's my legs. Dude, I don't have my pants legs sewed on, so I've got pants legs in there, and i got a Speedo swimsuit. By the way, my trail name is Speedo, and I got that 20 years ago on the trail because I used to hike. Instead of underwear, I would use a Speedo, and so when we got to a stream, I would yank everything off. And somebody saw me and called me Speedo and it stuck. Here's my wind, my woolies. These are long underwear, very fine merino wool, very lightweight, very warm, very necessary last night. Here's my rain hat that Ian and Nancy got me at REI Co-op. Here's my water bottle. That's what a platypus looks like. It's got two liters of water in it. Right now I'm drinking about four and a half, five liters a day. And then we get to other things I'm carrying. This is fuel for our stove. I'm carrying that. Here is kind of like the money bag. There's my credit cards. There's this uh, tobacco. There's my, my book, which I'm writing down interesting things. I think you've seen our spoon before, our spork and Sierra cup. This is a pack cover in case it's raining. Uh, the packs are pretty much um, water resistant, but they get wet and they get heavy, and we don't want them to get heavy. Here's the Otter Box. It has a spare battery in here for our phone so we can recharge them. And also I can fit my phone in there. Waterproof, shockproof, extra plastic bags. Here's the um, my toiletries. There's a toothbrush. Um, baking soda is what we, ba we brush our teeth with. I have in here a little um, goat bell that I picked up. 20 years ago on the trail. There's a little bit of trail magic. There's a comb. I don't need it because I shaved my head. There's my Cymbalta. I need that every day. Here's our first aid kit. Bunch of stuff in there. First aid wise for the trail. Very important. Toilet paper. Gotta have it. Here's the tack. Here's my snot rag. I've been using that a lot lately. And then here's my munchies. This is our gorp. Here are three pro bars. And that's pretty much it. All in all, full loaded, weighs about 25 pounds. And someday I'll show you a video of how we fit all of this stuff into one pack. Anyway, that's Jess Gear. See you down the trail.